<laughs> oh, I am so excited to get into the Creality Otter Light. I just received this. I have the Otter, I love the Otter, but when I heard that they now made a wireless solution, I had to check this thing out. So let's dive into it. Ooh, nice bag. Okay, so two things in here. They include a turntable, which is really handy. I like that. And we'll just open that up. Oh, that is fantastic. That's gonna really come in handy. Kudos for them on including that. Okay, and now let's go ahead and check out what we get in this case. So let's take a look. All right, so here we have our calibration. That's a calibration plate. We have the manual as well as stickers to mark your scans if you feel you need it. It's good to know that they include them. That's really nice. All right, and we have a converter for a USB A to USB C, a cloth, probably to clean and maintain your scanner, and a lanyard to hold on to the scanner. Let's see what we got inside here. All right, so right off the bat, you get this cute little owl. This is good for starting your first test. Here we have the cable, and this is gonna be if you wanna connect your scanner directly to the computer. And here we have the Creality light. Now all we need to do is connect it over here, and we are good to go. And wow, that's it. I, I think it comes with about an hour worth of scanning time from what I understand. I think one of the main differences between the Otter and the Otter Lite, this coming with the built-in Wi-Fi capability, which will be fantastic. The regular Otter, I will definitely tell you that when I have the cable, I constantly have to pull on the cable. And because these are proprietary cables, there is some customization on the cable for the Otter. It's really nice here when you have a wireless solution and you don't have to damage the USB port, etc. Another key thing to note between the two scanners, they're very close in capability in terms of features. However, their key difference is that if you're still looking for finer detail, you're going to want to go with the regular Otter if you're trying to get down to 0.02 millimeters. The Otter Lite will do a fantastic job, but it will go and scan down to 0.05 millimeters. But other than that, you're going to see and experience a lot of the same things that you get from the Otter, only now you have this fantastic wireless solution is gonna be so great. Another thing that we're definitely gonna do is we're gonna do a comparison on using a 3D scanner, such as something like the Otter Lite, and we're gonna compare it to using platforms that leverage AI and convert images to 3D. And when it comes down to the price, the price is only $645. It's a good price point for getting wireless and great accuracy from the scanner. And I can't wait to put it to the test. 